Hello, I'm Lorraine and I've been a community angel for a year now. My name's Martin Parker and I've been a community angel for about two and a half years. I'm Nikki and I've been a community angel for about four years now. A community angel is a befriender, someone who gets alongside someone else. What you're doing, you're working with somebody who might have become isolated and they just need to spend some time with somebody. I tend to meet people for coffee, just to get them out of the house, to have a chat with someone, to just reinforce them that uh, things are worth doing, that there's exciting things out there. It really is just spending some time chatting with somebody, being together, taking an interest in another person to try and build up their self-confidence. I have felt so blessed in my life with the, the community of the church that I have around me and my family, a large family. This was an opportunity to be able to give um, some support to other people who perhaps don't have such a, a network around them. I just thought this was something I could do for the community where I live. I got made redundant. My three kids all left home and I turned 50. It could have been a midlife crisis, but in actual fact it was one of the best things I've ever done. So when I retired, I was really keen that I would be uh, working directly with people, supporting them, and certainly getting involved with Community Angels, that was uh, perfect for that type of uh, voluntary work. What I enjoy most about Community Angels is the fact that you're meeting new people, developing new friendships. It can be people from very different backgrounds, different cultures, and um, I find that very interesting and enjoyable. So yes, I get a lot out of it, as well as putting um, a certain amount in. I have learnt a huge amount of empathy, which I didn't think I had maybe as much. Um, and you realise that everybody's got a story to tell. I love meeting people, I love hearing their stories. Sometimes people have had knockbacks and that can happen to anybody in any part of life. And um, I'd like to think that we're there to help pick them up again. So I'd say the best thing about it is getting to know these people. And I would say I have got more out of this than perhaps I've given to the people I work with. Because I am quite a selfish person in many ways and it's lovely to be told that you've made a difference to somebody's life. If you are considering becoming a community angel, I would say just go for it. Um, get involved in the training, which will give you a better insight into what it actually involves to be a community angel and take it from there, but I, I'd highly recommend it. So I would say go for it. It's been the best thing I've done since I retired. And um, I would just say I really feel that, I'd like to hope, to only a very few people, but I've made a difference to the community of Guildford. I live in the community, I want to make it a good place to be.